This is part 48 of Ocarina of Time 3D. We're uh, continuing our long, yes. long trading sequence to uh, to get the sword up. I can't even believe it's four parts. I know. Like, when I did, I was like, it didn't feel like it took that long, but I guess you're just a lot of riding, a lot of, well, really don't run at all, no, I guess, not but much. just a lot of area you got to cover, which would be cool if we hadn't been there already, but, yeah. you know, it's kind of getting redundant, which all Zelda games do towards the end. At least we do have a bonus horse now as an adult that makes it a lot easier, especially some of the timed parts yeah, uh -huh. a little later on. But yeah, I feel like we've, we've covered the ground. We're not really, really even close to the end. No. <laughs> so, like I say that, but we still have a long ways to go, too. Now, I like what you did here. Uh, it kind of looks like well, we... thank you. Well, I know, I don't give you credit very <laughs> often, and I'm sorry for that. But, like, how you just turned Epona around to kind of face the next direction. It's actually really smart because the next segment is going to be time. Yes. So getting Epona kind of facing the right way, it just shaves a couple seconds off your trip. You shouldn't need that time. Yeah, unless you totally screw up. Yeah. You should not need to turn Epona, <laughs> but it's just something like you don't have to mess with turning around when you yeah. get back out there. So, But you should really be fine as long as you're using her, which yeah. I don't know why you would not be. I, maybe if you just forgot to get her. If you're Austin Powers, you might try to run <laughs> That's right. across Hyrule Field, but nobody else would. Well, well, he stays on four in blackjack. So. <laughs> <laughs> or five, whatever I it is. suggest you hit, sir. <laughs> <laughs> now, I will say, I really like the shortcut that we have through Zora's River now. Uh -huh. Like, with the, the magic bean. It does take a little yeah, bit. We just recently planned that then. Wait, I remember yeah. we talking about the whole game. And we're like, oh, yep. here's where we finally figured it out. It took us about 40 parts. Yeah, I think, we didn't need it until then anyway. Exactly. So. But then kind of having to play Zelda's lullaby. Yeah. Um, every time. So sorry I had to burp. So I was kind of hoping you just go a little bit longer. <laughs> sorry, sorry. No, like you said, though, playing that song, like the uh, cinematic that comes with it is kind of cool. Yeah. But I get tired of playing that song every single time we have to come up here. Like Me too. That's one of those things, at least in the remake, I thought they could have gotten rid of. Just bam, you play it one time, you yeah. don't have to worry about it again. Well, if you don't like Zelda's Lullaby, you're really not going to like here in a few parts when we get to the next dungeon. <laughs> but that's neither here nor Oh, there. okay, okay. <laughs> I thought you were going to say the Sun Song because at the end of this oh, uh, big Goron Sword quest, we actually had to play that a couple times. Yeah. So. so we're going to be whipping that Ocarina Yeah, the next out. dungeon, we played Zelda's Lullaby quite a bit. Yes, we did. It's not as bad as the Command Song in oh. Wind Waker. <laughs> don't, get, don't get me started on the Command Song. <laughs> and that's a lot harder to play, too. Or oh. at least in my opinion, it is. Ugh. Now I'm thinking about the Earth Temple and I hate life. Like, there's a reason <laughs> I wasn't in music. Yeah. And so I'm sitting here, dude, oh... I sh I've still not done this to this day, but I want to put a video up of me trying to learn to wind waker. Oh my gosh. And the bat what's it called? The, not baton, uh, the whatever it's thing a, is. Is that what it's, it's called? It's a baton, yeah. I thought that was just like track or something. Oh, like the uh, relays. And you stuff know what like you that. know what I'm talking about. I'm not sure of the name. But um <laughs> well first of all we'll go ahead and talk about that random like yeah. <laughs> ice melting right there. The reason I kinda just had an extra uh what's it blue fire. The blue fire, yeah. And I knew that was there, so that was kinda just one of those things. I was on the way. Yeah. I said I'll go ahead and thaw this red ice in case I ever need to use it in the future, which I don't know. <laughs> but just kinda wanted to get out of the way. I think all that's in there and we saw it when we were child link, it is just a Zelda it, or it's the uh -huh. Zora store. Um, and there's yeah, really uh -huh. nothing in there that we You can need. buy the Zora tunic, but you get that for free, so you yes. don't want to do that. It's like a ridiculous price, I think, too. Can, can you even lose it at all? I uh, mean, no, you can't. Uh -uh. What purpose would there ever be to buy Unless it? there's some red fire somewhere. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Just burn, burn it right off poor Lee. Like, like vice versa. Yes. Now, what were we talking about before I uh, before the dethawing of ice? Oh, I don't know. oh crap! I can't uh, remember. Com oh, the command melody and the baton. And oh, I wanted to make a video of that. Oh, just me yes. trying to learn that. I just never did it because, <laughs> dude, it seriously took me like ten minutes to learn that stupid thing. It, it makes you wonder, like, when did music become such a big part of these? I think it was. I mean, the flute has kind uh -huh. of been in there since the beginning. Yeah, we did fast. Well, no, actually, in the original Zelda. Yeah, we had like a you had whistle, the flute. whistle, whistle. It was a whistle, huh? I think this game obviously took it to uh, a whole new level. Cause you actually had like notes. Yeah, you just didn't push a button. Whereas like Link to the Past had the flute. Like I don't know if you said that or not, but yeah, that one did. But this one, like you said, first time you kind of play music with the C buttons or yeah, whatever buttons are used in this game. Yeah, it's just it's weird that they've taken that music and it's been such a big part of. As you can tell, we're just trying to think of stuff to talk about right now yeah. as we run across Hyrule Field. But it is weird that they've incorporated music so much in these games. Talking about the Wind Waker. Well, that's every game, though, that does that. Very like, true. I mean, every game has music in, like, you know, 
The thing with Zelda is you have to evolve because Zelda's been around yeah. for so long, whereas most of these other franchises, they haven't been around, except for Mario. Except for Mario, yeah. <laughs> None of the other franchises have been around that long. Oh, we finally made it to our next destination, though. And I, I have nothing. <laughs> <laughs> well, there for a second I thought we were commentating Wind Waker and I'm yeah. like oh yeah we're commentating Ocarina of Time <laughs> well this guy actually cracks me up a lot because <laughs> yeah. when we we deliver the, the, the frog to him uh -huh. and he well we tried to it didn't yeah. work the first uh -huh. time but, <laughs> but then he just freaks out because he thinks that uh, it's food yeah, well, frogs apparently are a delicacy. I guess. And uh, Hyrule, so. I'm pretty sure I've never been this excited to eat something in my life as as he is right now. <laughs> yeah, but... and he's so, like, destroyed after he's like, wait, what? I'm not going to be able to eat them? <laughs> I mean, I guess we could have brought him two frogs. How are eyeball frogs an ingredient? Did, did you say I, that? How, no. How are I they no an ingredient in eye drops? Like, that makes no sense, really. I, that's the last thing I would want to put in my But eyes. then they're also eating eyeball frogs. Like I said, they're a delicacy, so. It, it's a miracle. There it's must be thing. something special to frogs in Hyrule. Yes. In case early on we do find out that they do jump to notes. Yes. Because they do get a heart piece from them. So. Oh, that's you know, that's a, I don't know. I don't have a clue. No, we do. <laughs> we kind of do it in both games a that's little true. bit, but we definitely get two heart pieces from playing music for frogs in yeah. this game. So now we'll say like four minutes to get all the way to Death Mountain doesn't seem like a lot of time, but again, we planted a magic bean that gives us a little bit of a shortcut getting yeah, uh -huh. up to the top. And I will say, if you screw up hopping one of these fences. Getting Epona like turn back around and straighten back that out is true. to get through can take a minute because she's not the easiest thing. I'm to experiencing control. that in Twilight Princess HD right yeah. now. Like I cannot steer Epona for my life. Oh my god! I gosh. just keep on running her into stuff and Me like too. It's, so, it's hard as heck to turn around. Like I said, <laughs> same thing in this game and. We're going all the way up to uh, Big Goron right now, are we? Yeah. We don't like, we don't quite make it all the way to him in this part, but that but that's where we're headed. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. I was trying to think of exactly where it ended. Yeah. So it, it is funny though talking about uh, Epona and Twilight Princess. I'm recording it for oh, our, I'm recording that game for it. our channel, and man, I hit like the acceleration button, and I went like maybe a foot. Yeah, like, the controls are great, except for Epona and Twilight Princess. <laughs> it's a great game, but yeah, I feel your pain yeah. on controlling. But like you're saying, I think you're talking about playing the Magic Bean on Death Mountain. Yeah, like, you definitely need to do that i'm not sure if it's impossible i think you can actually make it to big goron in i time, think so too but i know it's very very close yeah. not for might be the very last one I well this, remember, is, this is, a, is the last one we're taking in the eye drops so oh is, okay okay because all we have after this is the oh, uh the okay. sun song i knew well there's one more part so i was kind of i was getting confused on how much we had to do in that next part yeah as you can see i'm well prepared yeah. <laughs> for the coming videos that we have but i forgot there's some time anyways this will go ahead and wrap up part 48 of ocarina of time 3d